What up, YouTube? This is DJ Red and Rod, and this is gonna be our first ever. We're gonna do. We're gonna start a weekly thing. It's gonna be a Saturday night review on the latest album, maybe the latest mixtape. We never know. But this week we got whatever comes out, which is new. It just came out. I think two weeks ago. We didn't get to do it last week because you know we just thought of it now. We just thought of it like today, but it's a good idea. And it's gonna be Tyler the Creator's Goblin album. Just came out. I think May, May 10th. And we're going to do this track by track, let you know how we feel. We're going to give you the overall rating, let you know whether or not. Thumbs up, thumbs down. Burnt or not burnt. So, first track on it is Goblin. It's kind of like a dark, eerie... Goblin is the uh, the first track and the intro track. It's, it's, it's like him. It's a longer track. It's like him talking about how his conscience is talking to him. It's one of those hardcore tracks, I mean... Yeah, he's just talking about... What he what he's gonna do and how he thinks his career is gonna go. It's it's a little it's a little psycho. It's it's, weird, it's like, one of my favorites though. He, yeah, Tyler the Creator's uh, psycho guy. It's if you don't like psycho hardcore stuff, don't listen don't listen to him. No, not at all. The second track is Yonkers. That's like the hit of the album. Everybody loves that song. Yonkers is good. Yonkers is also a little weird. And uh, the track they have on the CD is is the extended track with the third the third verse. Cause most of the time on YouTube, if you look for it, it's only got the first two. I, I like the third verse the best. Yeah, the third it, it, verse. It goes hard. Yeah. It's it's, it it's it's pretty raw, and if that's probably one of the better tracks on it, um, the third track is Radicals. It is definitely the most controversial of the three tracks, and it's probably like the whole thing is just like the chorus itself is kill people, buy stuff, f school, you know. So, but the end. This this track goes yeah. so hard that he has to put a disclaimer in the beginning of it. Yeah. It's 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 a little pointless, but it's 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 a good track. And then let's see. Fourth is she, she. with Frank Ocean. I like Frank Ocean because he's a singer and a rapper. He's got his Drake thing going on, you know. Yeah. It's pretty dope. But and it's it's another odd one. It's a stalker song for sure. It, it is. Uh, the chorus. How's the chorus go? I, it's like I don't remember, but he's he goes, like he's in the he's like in the window like checking out this girl like just stalking him. And I could see Tyler doing that. And it goes, uh, who's in your window? Swag. Uh, it's, it's it's pretty. It's weird. I like it though. Um, Transylvania is the fifth track, and it's not one really one of my favorites. It kind of. No, uh, not. Yeah, the, these middle couple tracks don't really catch attention much, but. Yeah, except for six is Nightmare. Nightmare goes pretty hard. Yeah, Nightmare's a good one. Nightmare's pretty dope. Tron Cat is a little weird. Just by the title, you can tell it's called Tron Cat. It's 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 weird, but I like it. It's it's pretty dope. Eight is called Her. It's like she, but you know her. And also another love song. Well, not really love song, more like stalker song. Love but, song. <laughs> uh, I still think it's cool. Number nine is probably probably the one of the best ones. It's, it's Sandwiches with Sandwich. Haji Beats. Yes, if you haven't heard this, because it's been out for a while, if you haven't heard this, listen to it, definitely. Sandwiches it's probably awesome. goes the hardest out of all of them. It does. Ten's, uh, ten's called Fish. It's probably the most sexual <laughs> of all of the tracks. Definitely. It's no, never mind. There's another one. There's another Is one. Is there? Yeah, I'll, I'll we'll get there. Eleven's called Analog. It's it sounds a lot like Transylvania to me. Nothing big. Just to listen to I, it once. I can't say much. I haven't listened to that that song. I kind of whatever. Yeah. The twelfth one's called. I can't say it because it's it's had the whole title itself. It's called B Suck D. Yes. Use your imagination. It's pretty hardcore. You can just imagine <laughs> what the song's about. It's it's. That's not one of my favorites, actually. Thirteenth is called Window, and it has everybody from Odd Future. Uh, if you if you don't know already, Odd Future is their, their rap group. Their rap group, Odd Future, Wolfgang, Kill Them All. Or or Golf Wang. Golf if Wang. You, if you will hear it on the CD. They flip whatever, but it's w Window has everybody in it, and it, it everybody's in it. So you get a taste of everybody from Odd Future, and I like it. Fourteen is AU AU seventy nine. It's an instrumental, but I like it. I think I, I'd use it. For you don't you don't see a whole lot of rappers anymore. Giving put, put pretty much giving out free beats. Still yeah. got you still got to use their rights or whatever. But still, the only other person I've seen put a, an, an instrumental on their CD is the Beastie Boys' new album. Yeah, which yeah. which we could have reviewed, but we chose Tyler instead. Tyler's a good. Yeah, fifteenth is called Golden, and it's like his ending track. It's like his outro, and it's a lot like Goblin, where he's talking to his subconscious, or his therapist, or his therapist, which is actually him, and he's like losing his mind and. He reveals to himself at the end that he's talking to himself and he's psycho. Nothing, nothing new. I expected that. Yeah, if you if you don't know Tyler Creator already, that's basically what you expect from him is 
to Tim talking to himself, but he didn't really know it. Mm -hmm. And then, crazy. that's that. If you do, if you get the normal normal version, that's the end of it. And if I were to just say the normal version, I'd give it out of what? Out of ten, I'd give it a seven and a half. Seven and, seven and, and a half for the ten. If you're just gonna get the normal version, but in the deluxe version, it comes with three extra songs, which is Burger with Haji Beats. Burger's dope. Oh, they, I, I can't say much. I, I didn't download the deluxe version. I got the deluxe version. It's pretty sick. I'm not going to lie. 17 is called Untitled 63. It's another instrumental. It's pretty good. I like it. I'd use it. It's, all, it's a short song. It's like a minute. But I, I, I'd freestyle to it if I could. And then 18th is called Steak Sauce. And I, I, I it's it's like Transylvania and and uh, Analog. I don't really listen to it that much. It's it's whatever. Yeah. But that those are only the three. So if I were to, if I were to say... With those tracks, because of Burger, I would give it an, an 8. 8 out of 10. I, yeah, I'd say 7.5, 8. Maybe. Deluxe, deluxe version, 8. So get the deluxe version. It's worth it. Um, but overall, this whole this whole CD, I would say, very, very good. Very good. Yes. But if you're not used to like crazy, controversial things, don't get it. Because <laughs> you'll, you'll turn it off after the first 20 seconds of hearing it. Yes, it's very, very weird, very controversial, very dark. But if you like, he, he's not your average rapper. He's your kind of rapper oh, no. that he's not afraid to speak his mind. And if you think he's a devil, he'll call himself the devil just to piss you off because that's just the way he rolls. He's like, if if you haven't listened to Eminem, if you haven't listened to him, Eminem, he he says whatever he wants without without caring. He's kind of like that, Eminem. but but darker and a lot scarier. Yeah, he has this whole creep st stilo that he likes to do. And it's like go watch the Yonkers video. It, it's it's that's how I started liking Tyler. He was crazy. He just like eating yeah, cockroaches he, and puking and hanging himself. Yeah, watch watch Yonkers on YouTube. The the music video. Even watching them perform sandwiches is crazy because yeah, they yeah. they just like to go off. They don't care about what anybody thinks. That's that's just what they do. Text message. <laughs> but um, yeah, that's that's track by track for Goblin. Very good CD. If you like crazy stuff, if not, don't get it because you'll probably be offended and you'll probably cry. A little, a bit, little yes. bit, but definitely. So that's our week weekly pick for this week. Goblin Tyler Crater, seven out of five for him, eight for me. Go get it. It's DJ Red and Rod. We're signing out. BTC Sun. Peace out.